Welcome to my channel, exploring old technologies and seeing new ideas. Let's begin. There's lots to explore before you throw old appliances out. Consider the interesting parts inside. At least that old microwave may have some screws for your next project. First disconnect it and then get your tools out and start the disassembly journey. Have you ever wondered how the table motor that's in a microwave actually gets its power? Interestingly enough, some microwaves actually derive that power from the fan that cools the magnetron. The fan is actually broken into uh, two sections, uh, whereby it can actually provide 24 volts of power as an auto transformer from the winding that runs the fan. Here you can see the fan and the table motor uh, wired up, and you'll see the voltage that's being generated by the winding on the fan motor to run the little fan and what the residual voltage is across that winding. Just let me turn it on and you'll have a look. As I apply 120 volts of AC line voltage to the circuit, the white fan motor's winding splits out 23 volts of AC power for the small table motor. A balance of 100 volts is shown on the meter above. Now let's take that table motor and put it back into the microwave box, along with the light and create a 19 inch wide, 9 inch high, and 1 foot deep photo box. This is one simple example of how you can repurpose an old appliance. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll be looking forward to preparing another one for you soon.